What are you most looking forward to doing once we get on the other side of this pandemic? Be able to go places. Not actually going. Just being able to a vacation since I don't get to stop working now. Getting my hair cut. This has really driven home how social I had really become. My schedule has literally not changed. I realize that I really need to get out and change that. <laughs> not wondering if my mild chest pain is the coronavirus or just anxiety from the coronavirus. I want to hug everyone. Getting caught on by strangers in the street during large gatherings, and then touching my face, and never washing my hands. Sitting in my local with a nice pint of Guinness watching football. I will never take that for granted again. Edit. Holy shit. My first award, and I was not expecting this many upvotes. Thank you friends. Guess we are all missing this feeling. Stay safe and stay strong go to the grocery store with my kid, walk through the toy sections, let him walk around and choose his favorite stuff. Just be normal again. Staying home because I want to not, because I have to. Finding a new girlfriend, just broke up after 9 years. Probably that date I finally landed, but got cock blocked by the coronavirus. Oh well. Going to the grocery store with the week's list, and not having to improvise new meals due to a nearly empty produce section. Getting married. I just had to cancel the wedding that I've been planning for almost two years. Removed. I had a phone interview for a job today. It would be a $15.000 slash years increase over what I'm making right now. The director said she liked me and wanted move forward. But it's going to be slow because the university I would be working for is not allowing in-person meeting until this is all over. I've been crushing on this guy at work and am sure that he feels the same. I'm ready to shoot my shot when we get out of this mess. Working. Lowered housing prices. Then buying a house. This whole thing really just got me thinking about all the limits we put on ourselves for trivial reasons. People who you cut off stop yourself from talking to because of shit that's over and done with. Things you're afraid to do, but aren't big deals. I don't like living half-assed for no reason, and living on lesser means for a good reason makes you realize that. Movie theater's my favorite thing to do. Finding a job. Getting the fuck off reddit, because there are better things to do. About a week, before we started social distancing, one of my close friends, and I found out, that we both had a massive crush on each other the whole time. And upon learning this started an intense and incredible relationship which has now been put on hold, while we are stuck at home and separate sitters horny out of our minds. So I'm really looking forward to seeing her again. In all simplicity, that and buying a bag of pasta. Playing live music again, I lost a shit ton of income, which I will attempt to get back any way possible. But losing the way of resetting yourself every couple of days slash weeks sucks. Going stir crazy. Go out and get fucked up. And also just go to the gym. And to work. I miss talking to people in real life. Open bracket. Going back to the gym. Hey, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.